Taylor Moody. I'm 14 years old. I've been playing soccer for about seven years. I just like the spectacular saves you make. The, I just get a lot of enjoyment from them. It just makes me want to keep on moving forward and so and goalkeeping. And just when you hear the crowd, just you know, get off, off their seats when you make a spectacular save. It just makes me very happy and just saving a team from what could have been a goal and could have just lost them like a final or something. I feel it's more important than scoring a goal for a team because saving a team is better than just, you know, scoring. Because scoring will always be the winner for a game. And just the lateral saves I make, the spectacular upper 90 saves I make. I think PKs are the most my, my favorite thing that happens because like if you save one it's it's just a spectacular save but if you miss it it's just like not the end of the world because PKs are just PKs they're they don't they shouldn't be the decider of a game it's if you make a save it's spectacular if you don't make a save then just move on I've done lots of training, like new era. I've done goalkeeper training. I've done CrossFit training to get stronger. And yeah, just seeing all that training like happen, help me improve in a game has just been remarkable. Well, I feel you just have to organize your team to be the captain of your team and just organize your players so that a chance will happen where you might concede a goal. The most important position on the field and when you make those saves, it's just a very big moment for your team, for yourself. I used to get scored on a bunch in the game, so I mean, it's different now because I don't get scored on as much because my team's a lot better than it used to like than my other team. But um, I kind of got gotten used to just the fact that if a goal goes in, well, what can you do to to change that? You can't go back in time because goal, goals are gonna happen. You're never gonna have zero goals on you in your life. You just have to move on from them. I work on my mentality. And then just so just throw a ball at a rebounder and try to improve on the things that I can. Yeah. We're trying to raise funds for our, my Spain trip I'm going on in the summer. Well, in Spain, we'll be getting trained by a professional Spanish teams such as like Real Madrid and possibly. Well, we will be playing against their academy teams, so, and that'll be really fun playing against professionals because that all means improve and see their level of play in Spain, which will be very important to my career. I hope this training will help me achieve um, success in a soccer career. I hope I can play college, professional, I hope I can get a good scholarship for college and maybe go professional. Yes, we've done fundraisers such as Pampered Chef and I've also done refing to raise money. The coaches have just helped me out a lot and helped me improve my game a lot. And I don't think I had very many of those in the past. You just use your head and whatever comes to your head, you just tell them to do. So if you see a certain angle open, you tell them to move to there. And if you see people open, you tell them to mark them. I feel like you just it's just basically a game where you use your mind. And you just say what comes off your mind. Thank you, I really appreciate you watching this video. Uh, any donation will help massively, so I really appreciate it.